What's up guys? It's Sam from Couple of Ketos here. Today, I'm going to show you guys something you're probably not going to believe, but we're going to be making Gordon Ramsay style scrambled eggs in the microwave. Yep. Alright, so first thing you need to do, get a microwave safe bowl, crack four eggs in it, and then beat them up. Alright, once you're done with that, put a splash of heavy whipping cream in there. Don't use too much or else this thing is going to fluff up way too big. It's going to mess everything up. So just about half a tablespoon I would say. And then you're going to want to break up a piece of yellow American cheese. That's our favorite way to make this. You can obviously use your favorite cheese if you want to. I know this is kind of processed but it's the best taste to us. So you're gonna go start and just break up one piece of that, put it in the mixture. And then just give it one more stir. Okay, now you're gonna put it in the microwave. This is the important part. It's really easy to overcook these, doing them in the microwave. So what you want to do is start with 45 seconds, take them out, stir it up, and go from there. I don't know why I was already set like a minute and 45 seconds, I didn't know. And while you're waiting on that, you can always eat a piece of cheese. Also, thank you for your concern about my hands. Just want to show you guys that we do have a pot holder. It's right here. I'm going to use it for you guys. How about that? And so when you take these out of the microwave, they're going to look half cooked just like this. And then you're gonna to wanna to just kinda of break them up a little bit more. Starting to form the little egg chunks. All right, that's about good. And then at that point, what you're gonna to wanna to do is break up another piece of cheese, yellow American. And this is actually how my dad taught me to make eggs when I was a little kid. And I pretty much always cook them this way. And it makes things um, easier if you're cooking something else on the stove and you just don't want to have to be so worried about it. You can kind of put these in the microwave in short little increments and not be so worried that they're going to get away from you if you're paying attention to something else. <clears throat> All right, so we're actually gonna go ahead and put these back in the microwave. We're only gonna do it for 30 seconds this time. All right, so you can tell they're getting a little bit more cooked now. Just wanna break them up again. everything around and then break up one more piece of cheese and the ratio here it doesn't matter how many eggs well however many eggs you use you use one less piece of cheese so this is four eggs I'm breaking up three pieces of cheese total to put in here one more quick stir And then we're going to put it back in the microwave for 30 more seconds. I want 
forget the pot holder. We're getting really close here. Probably only gonna have to go back in the microwave one more time. Probably, probably about 20 seconds, we'll see. Exactly what you want. You can see it's kind of just a little bit liquidy on the top. Just a little bit though. That's perfect. That's where we want them at. So now when you stir these up, they come out to be the most creamy, delicious eggs that you've ever had. And to me, they taste like Gordon Ramsay style eggs, and I've made those before. These are just a little bit easier. So there you go, guys. That's how you make Gordon Ramsay style eggs in the microwave. My name is King Iso, <laughs> and I felt like singing. I woke up this morning, no recollection of me Looked in a mirror here, but there was no reflection to see I had a feeling this would happen, I've accepted defeat Hope I still tell myself I love you, though, whenever we meet Is it true we love you?